so before we get into this video, I want to give a big shout out to Velvet Caviar for sponsoring this video. You guys probably saw all over my Instagram these really cute phone cases that they collab with the Bratz. I'm obsessed with Y2K fashion. You guys already know that. And I'm obsessed with the Bratz dolls. And I just love this collection. It's so cute. I've been having this one on my phone and have this little charm. I just love it because I can just like carry it around. I get so many compliments on it. And I know a lot of you guys probably got new phones for Christmas. And I feel like this is like your pretty go to to butt protective phone cases. This one I actually wanted to put on my phone right now because I feel like it's perfect for the season. It's like the sweater material and then we have a marble one. It's really pretty as well. And then this one is like mirrored. These are some of their matching accessories and this is a power pack. It's magnetic. I think it's so cute that they made it the same print. And this one, I actually have the grip for it. It's a phone grip. So pretty. So I wanted to give you guys a close up. Oh my God, this one's so white 2 k and this one has like reflection and little stars. This one I actually put the phone grip on. And then look at this butterfly one. You guys know I'm obsessed with butterflies. They're actually really firm, but yet really flexible. And they have this really nice velvety interior. It just feels really high quality. So if you got a new phone for Christmas, you obviously want to protect your phone in style. And these phone cases never go on sale. But right now for my followers, you can buy one, get one free for only 24 hours. So you guys need to hurry up. Make sure to use my discount code CarlaBOGO at checkout and all the links will be in the description. All right guys, so I'm really excited to show you guys my tree and you guys know about two years ago we did a Christmas tree like little tour and it was Harry Potter themed. And you guys know me and Kama are both really obsessed with Harry Potter. Yeah, I just feel like every time this time of year comes by, I always rewatch all of the movies and I don't know, I'm a big Harry Potter fan. So I'm gonna show you guys the tree, so come on. So this year we went bigger and better. So last time I did it, it was a froth tree. It was a lot shorter and smaller, but this time I had more space to play with. And I also chose a green tree, and this tree in particular has already lights in it, so it has little tiny little lights. And I loved how this whole tree was just so aesthetically pleasing. Even without the decorations, it looked really, really pretty. But anyways, we're gonna start with probably the top of the tree. So obviously we have the sorting hat at the very top. Cayman had to help me out with that one because it's unreachable for me. Yeah, it's other <laughs> here. This is it, guys. <laughs> I literally had to be on the store. Yeah, this is my scarf actually from my actual cape and gown I got at Universal Studios. Then we have all the Harry Potter letters. This is how they look like. I actually made these. I actually got this wax last time that I did it. I melted all the wax and made these little stamps. A cute little touch and I feel like it's more authentic that way if you make it a DIY project for yourself. Then we have little ornaments that represent it. We have some wands. I think this one's Harry's wand. And then the one that my mom got me it's a little bit bigger. I'm not sure whose wand this is because it's different from that one. That's Harry's wand for sure. This one it could be Hermione's, it could be Ron's, I have no idea. And then we have the nine and three quarters, if you guys already know. The station where they enter Hogwarts, that is the number where they go in. These scarves right here that I made into bows, my mom got them for me and I didn't really know what to do with them. I was like, you know what, just grab them for me. So I made them into bows, they're actually scarves. Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw, Gryffindor. So then it's the only one that's missing. And then we have Harry's owl. There's actually a couple owls around here because I wanted it to make sense with the letters, obviously. And then this, so it's a broom, um, and it actually smells, it did smell like pumpkin spice, but not anymore. We have the golden snitch. You have to really, really look, but we actually have the flying keys right here. I made those also. They're all around here, but they're so tiny that you can barely see them. I still wanted to add it for the, for the vibes. And then obviously we have ones that represent like Hogwarts, the castle. I mean, yeah, that's pretty much it. I went for all the colors, obviously, of all the houses. We have green for Slytherin, we have the burgundy for Gryffindor, blue for Ravenclaw, and then obviously I added some gold and black to just kind of go more with houses that include those colors as well. And the other DIY project that me and Kevin are actually going to do today, I'm going to show you guys, it's really, really cool. These are the magic candles, and I got them on Amazon. I actually saw a reel on Instagram and one of you guys sent it to me and I was like this will be perfect for my Harry Potter themed 
vibes. So there will be the floating candles that are always in the great hall. And you'll just turn them. It's the on and off button right here. Obviously, Cayman's gonna have to help me because I can't reach. I got all stockings. These are all from Target, Harry Potter themed. And I thought they were really cute because it would go perfectly with my vibe. My mom got this for me. So that's pretty much it right now. Obviously, guys, we have the gifts. These are for everybody. These are for the whole fam. We gotta wrap them up. There's also a fireplace here, but I told Carl to not turn it on because <laughs> I don't want the house to go up in flames. Over here, I'm not sure if we're gonna post the video or not before this or after, but I surprised Carla with some Grinch flowers. I love the Grinch. You guys might have already seen the video or not. I don't know yet. Right now, guys, we're actually going to be wrapping all the gifts. We're gonna be hanging up all of the floating candles. It should be all decorated. Like I said, we're still moving into like the blinds and stuff are kind of like off. Yeah, I that's mean, why this looks crazy. Wait, look at this one. Oh my gosh. The curtains are here. They just have to come install them. So we'll have all this by like 2023. <laughs> but we're still in the process of moving. <laughs> we're also, our couch should be coming next month too. Oh yeah. So there's a lot of exciting things. And our out. dining table. Dining table. You know what I'm saying? But we're going to get on uh, wrapping and getting this shit going. Because Christmas is coming up. Like we have to get this done. So let's go. Okay guys, we made a little bit of progress. Carl's wrapping one of the last couple of gifts. Well, there's a lot more, but the other ones need bags because they're loose items or they need boxes, so. We wrapped a couple, these are mine. So beautiful, look at that, gorgeous. But now guys, we're going to attempt to hang up these floating candles. That's my job. I just wanna show you guys how they work. So you click this and they, they all turn on. Lumos, they turn on. Kids, don't try this at home. <laughs> What's crazy is, I'm tall. And I'm still not at the ceiling. I, I feel like I'm really high up. This is crazy. Imagine if I was this tall. Uh-uh, absolutely not. That. That but look cool. guys, these things have like a little sticker and then you put them up. Ooh. This is cool though. It kind of looks like you can't even see the strings from no, far away. Lumas. <laughs> they look like they're really floating over there. Now my Harry Potter dreams are I'll come in it's literally like 11 30 at night we literally had to go to target just a second ago to get more batteries just for those lights but we did some good decorations today and we wrapped a lot of gifts so we're pretty much ready to go tomorrow we'll be going to get some food and stuff to prepare because i'm going to be cooking the stuff that i didn't get to cook on thanksgiving i'm excited wait hold on what the hell is that a booger i feel like a booger <laughs> I'm really happy about my Chris, our Christmas tree. Kevin did a really good job. Actually, he was putting him up, even though I could see them from far away. He was like doing it perfectly. He did a really good job. Today, we're going to the grocery store to go get food for the Christmas munchies that I'm planning on making. Carla's gonna help soup. She's gonna be my sous chef. I'm gonna be like the cleaning, preparing person. Mind you guys, this right here is a pimple patch for everybody that always has. Why does Carla always have on some stars on her face? I get it, cause it's like, well why do you, why does she have some stars on her face? Cause they're for pimples, it's not sponsored or anything, but they get rid of your pimples quicker. Not like instantly, but quicker. So you put one on, like you wear it for like a day or two, then your pimple's basically going. For real. Guys use them too, I use them too all the time. We just got everything we needed from the store. See what we got, looking here, we got some candy, some cheese. <laughs> Ooh, the guy what said is... that he blacked out on that. Blacked out? He said he drank it straight. We got a lot of good stuff, we'll show you when we get home, but we didn't want to waste time just showing us grocery shop, it would've been more. We're making a nice Christmas dinner. You got some turkey breast. Now, I didn't make this, but this is from Honey Baked. They make really good turkeys and stuff like that, so we're gonna heat this up. I'm kinda cheating a little bit. I don't know if you guys seen on TikTok like two years ago, it's like the tomato feta pasta. It's really easy to make. So instead of mac and cheese, we're making that. It's really good, me and Carla have it all the time. You like it, right? Yeah, I love it. We're gonna be making some garlic green beans and then we're gonna make some roasted potatoes. Oh, I also have some chicken that I'm marinating. Oh, yeah. It's right here. It's marinating all day. So I'm gonna go grill this outside and this should be really good too. This is a uh, pollo asado. Ooh, man. What? I'm gonna make this pomegranate rosemary. It's supposed to be cranberries, but I don't have any. It's a drink. Oh, and I have desserts on the way. Yeah, we also got some desserts in there. Should we show them what we got? I ate some last night. Oh, and the little snowballs too. I ate some of those cookie you things. You ate some? I wanted to taste it. Yay. <laughs> There are these cookie brownie things from Church Rose. They're really good. And, and then we have hot cocoa bombs. And then later on, we're doing s'mores. And then if we do have movie night, remember, we have this. Oh, and then we also got those too, remember? These we're going to lay out. Like, all these little stuff we're going to lay out. And then with the pasta, guys, we're actually going to be making this bread right oh, it's here. it's so good. 
good. This bread is so good. It's from Trader Joe's. Focaca. Wait, Fochichi. Fochachi. What? Say, what does it say? What does it say? Fochia? Folk. Fokashi. Fokakia. <laughs> Too many glockies. Okay, come on. <laughs> Carla just got a special delivery from the door. What are these? It's called nothing but bundt cake. Dun, dun, dun. Sheesh. So there's lemon, red velvet, chocolate, strawberry, cheesecake. So we have a lot of good stuff going today, guys. Yeah. I'm excited. I'm excited to cook. They're actually doing construction kind of right now in our backyard, and I think they're almost done. I'm gonna show you guys. Hold on. They just sprayed it down. And I don't know if you guys remember last time, but we didn't have any of this back here. Now there's like plants, there's mulch, they're cleaning off the deck, and there's some stuff over there, so. Once they're done back there, I can start grilling, but for now we're gonna start cooking, let's go. All right guys, so this tomato feta pasta is really easy. It's literally like four ingredients, cherry tomatoes, feta cheese, and olive oil. That's like the base, and you put like salt, pepper. So I'm gonna just start off. I'm doubling up the recipe, so I'm gonna do four of these. So one, two, <laughs> this is a lot of tomatoes. Three and four. I've actually never made this much, so we're gonna see how this goes. The recipe calls for actually a half cup of olive oil, so we're gonna do two. We actually got these from Disneyland. Remember these? Mm -hmm. So we're gonna do two of these. This might seem like a lot of olive oil, guys, but it's really not that much. You're making like a, a base, it's like a sauce. And we're gonna do two. So we got two of these. All right, next up, guys, Carla actually got these electric pepper and salt shakers. These are really cool, you just press the button. And then you got pepper. So you're gonna season this with just salt and pepper. Honestly, you can put whatever you like in here. It's really up to you. So we're gonna put some salt. Now right, guys, this is the base to a sauce, so don't be scared to put a nice generous amount of salt. Next up, we wanna just toss these around. Get those tomatoes nice and coated. Next up, you wanna put the feta cheese in here. And you kinda also wanna like get this coated with a little bit of olive oil at the bottom. So we got boom, and then you got boom. This looks a little crazy right now, but after you bake it, it turns into a sauce. This is the base for your pasta. It's really, really good. You guys will see. We're gonna put this in the oven for about 45 minutes until these tomatoes kind of burst and get a little brown. All right, guys, we're gonna let that bake. And now we're gonna start on the rest of the stuff. All right, this is for all the people that say, Carla, don't be in the kitchen. Guess where she's at? That's wifey right there. <laughs> I'm making roasted potatoes. So we're just cutting them up right now. We have a lot low key. Guess what? Then we can use them for breakfast. Guys, I'm gonna chop these up and I'll see you guys in a minute. So I chopped up all the potatoes. Okay. And the green beans. Okay, I see now you. We're gonna hold see. on, hold on. Give Carla a like right now because she in here whipping it up. This is a miracle. No, you can cook. You can just, you I, know just I like to cook. Yeah, you like to cook. But she did a good job. We're gonna add some olive oil. All right guys, so Carla, she had a ring on, so I'm gonna do this part. But we'll put some olive oil in the potatoes and we're gonna put some salt and some pepper. I like to like eyeball all of my seasonings, but this could go good or bad. Then we're gonna put some salt in here. Mix this up. You ain't gotta go too, too crazy with the salt. You wanna make sure like these are seasoned enough. This is a lot, this is like three pounds of potatoes. Mm -hmm. Then we're gonna go in with some pepper. I love having these like automatic grinders because they just like make my life so much easier. This pepper smells really fresh. Okay, next up we wanna do two tablespoons of minced garlic. This is obviously a teaspoon, but I'm gonna eyeball this as well. It's about a tablespoon. Me and Carla put red pepper flakes in everything. Literally. Just cause we like spicy shit. These smell kind of good. Want to smell them? Yeah, it smells really yummy. Mm. All right, guys. So just imagine fresh garlic, potatoes. These look good already. Okay. Now we're going to transfer these to a baking sheet, and we're going to get them baking because potatoes look you take a long time. These smell good, though. They smell really nice and garlicky. All right, guys. So we're transferring these over to the sheet. Just going to spread them out in like a nice little even layer. Hopefully, this pan is big enough. I think it will be, though. There we go. Now we're going to put these in the oven. And we got potatoes. So we got the tomato feta pasta up here, the sauce boiling, and then we have the potatoes down here. Yeah, it looks good so far. So I just got done grilling. It smells really good, by the way. Damn. Ooh, it smells, smells really good. So I actually want to try it. This piece is kind of burnt, though. I really haven't tasted it yet, so I don't know how it's going to be. Mmm. Wait. Okay. That's so good. It's like it has a nice spice to it. Mm. I like that. 
I like it too. That's so it's good. So juicy too. 10 out of 10. All right guys, so quick little update. We have our bread chopped up. We're gonna lay this down on a baking sheet. That's at the end though and everything's ready. Got the green beans done, chicken's done. I kind of been munching on it, so I've been hungry. Let's check on the oven. At the bottom, you guys see our potatoes. They're roasting pretty nicely. And then this is actually what you want your sauce to look like. So we're gonna take this out soon and we're gonna mash it all together to be a nice sauce. And then also we're making our pasta. This is the pasta that we use. That's from Trader Joe's, it's called Giggly, Jiggly. We're gonna use this pasta and then we're gonna combine it with the sauce in there. It's gonna be really, really good. We're gonna add fresh garlic and basil. We have some little gingerbread, mm -hmm. some forever shirt. These are my favorite, my mom's favorite, and my brother's favorite. We're gonna put this in a cute little plating situation and then I actually have to plate all that stuff over there and probably just put aluminum foil. But yeah. This is the sauce that's gonna be for the pasta. You're just gonna wanna mash this up. So literally we're just gonna go in here. It's gonna look a little weird at first, but you kinda wanna burst all of these little tomatoes together until you get like a nice sauce. And you see it's getting saucy, okay. It kinda looks like lasagna or something. It does. You just wanna mash this down until it all becomes kinda one sauce. And it's okay if there's like kinda chunks of tomatoes because they're actually really good. Mm -hmm. You like those, huh? Yeah, I like those. Right yeah, but you guys probably seen this pasta on TikTok. It, it was definitely on TikTok before. That's my timer. But I'm gonna mash this up and then we're gonna put the pasta in and then we'll go. Wait, I have to wash this too. Look, I brought you so many things, so, because I know you're not the best host. Oh! Oh, do you not see my little... Yeah, look, I brought some stuff to upgrade you. Look, I brought my little thingy. I'm going to make two fun charcuterie boards. I brought all the little things. I got some caramel cookies. Look, look at all this fun stuff I got you. These pickles are from England. These are grilled. Oh, wow. are you gonna Maybe we can make like a dirty board? martini. Yeah, these are all going. Oh, and I just bought this big ass bottle of tequila. Look, organic honey. Are this for me or are you going to take this back? Well, I'm going to be here eating this stuff oh, anyway. Yeah. And then look, but this is like, oh, I got a bunch of cheese. I got more stuff over here. Oh, look, so the cranberry. You're going to, oh, it's me right now. See, I'm going to that flower. Cute. But we're going to make it so cute. Look, did you see my wrapping? Oh, wait, how did you do that? Ah, what is in there? A cup. Oh. <laughs> Mama está limpiando ahí la mesa. Oh, oh, so I can't cook or clean. I don't know how to do anything. Mira, le dejó el Mira, los flores que me agarró came in. Hace dos días los trajo. Este puede ser una. Oh my god. Con ¿Cómo se llama este? El monito. El Grinch. This is Gucci. Say hi to everybody. He's on his puppy vibes right now. Fun fact, he's supposed to be my dog. And then I picked him out and everything. And my mom was like, oh yeah, this is your dog. And then he got so attached to my mom. And he ended up being my mom's instead. Because he never liked me. He never wanted to sleep with me. He always wanted to be with my mom. So yeah, so he ended up being my mom's. All right, guys, so it is time to eat. We got a lot of good food. Are you excited? Yeah, I'm really excited. It, everything looks so good. I obviously didn't get the memo. Like, everybody's wearing black, and I'm over here wearing this red-ass sweater. I'm doing this because I have to take a picture of this, but yeah, yeah. we're going to start off by just showing what everybody made. So these are the potatoes that we were making earlier, guys. That came mm -hmm. out really, really good. This is the turkey. This is the pasta. Green beans. Bread. And then there's dessert. It's a tree. Do you see the little star I cut? Oh, it's a Christmas tree. It's a tree. This is the one boy I made this tree. And then this one, this one's just like on the farm, like very raw, very real, very organic. Hey, if you guys eat this right now, let us know in the comments. Yeah, no, if you will hire me to make your charcuterie or let me know in the comments. Too. What are you making over here? I'm making everybody drinks. I'm making a rosemary slash grapefruit cranberry. I have my little ice cubes here that are trees. And then the little gingerbreads. So I have it all planned out, but I think this is gonna be yummy. Okay guys, so I'm actually a bartender tonight. Um, everybody needs to leave me a good tip, by the way. We're not leaving her no tip. Let's just drink it good. Hey, it's gonna be good. Me estoy haciendo una bebida porque se, si me van a dejar buen tip, eh? Buen tip? Uh-huh. Bartender. I'm a bartender tonight. These look good. Did you try it? No, yeah, my mom said it's good, so I don't know yeah, if I believe good. Is it good? My mom yeah, says good. everything I make is good, though. Yeah. I'm just finishing these off. All right, guys, we're going to try the drink that Carla just made. She's bartender. You guys ready? Yeah. Pa' arriba, pa' dentro, pa' dentro. Pa' arriba, pa' arriba, pa' abajo. Pa' dentro, pa' dentro. Wow. Mm. Okay, I did pretty good. Oh. 
But that's pretty good. Like that's what you want. Right? The Miana is strong. Mom's is actually a lot better. We gotta make everybody take a shot. Okay, a shot. Yeah. Everybody takes a shot. Yes, yeah, you got. I'll take a shot. No. Wow. Yo con este. Si no me voy a echar. Mom, just take it. Are we opening presents? At it's 12? Christmas. Yeah. All right, we're taking a shot. You gave your mom a baby shot? No, my mom poured the rest in ours. I saw her do it. Two. New year, new adventures, new stuff. And good and, vibes. And Christmas. And Christmas. And, Christmas. Christmas and, being and many family. more Christmases. Christmases together. And the first Christmas in, in the your house. new house. Yeah. The new house, yeah. And, uh -huh. Ready? Cheers. Ready? Cheers. Salud. 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 Uh, That's not that bad. This is not bad. This is good. So we're gonna put on our matching pajamas. It's giving Gryffindor, Ravenclaw. If you know the vibes, you know the vibes. But that's what I wanted it for. Fenty, what? Go, stop. Okay, so this one's for you. Thank you so much. This one's yours. Thanks. And this one's yours. Muchas gracias. Muchas gracias. So everyone go put on their pajamas and then we're gonna come back downstairs and we're gonna open our gifts. Okay. Ready guys? A few moments later. So we are starting to open gifts. Louis, are you ready? Yeah, and I'm really excited. Oh, let's go. all show them our... Oh, matching pajamas. Matching pajamas. My mom has hers on too, but she's getting something from the car. No, she's getting the keys for me because I need to go get the last couple of your gifts from the car. But I'm so excited to show you them. Are you going first? Is that what you're Yeah, I know. I want to see your reaction. Oh, okay. Mine's the Oh, I Oh. Oh. Orange boxes. They're Birkins. Is it a Birkin? All right, this is for me to you. I got you stuff in here too, but it's for both of you guys technically, because it's for your home. <laughs> oh my God! Yes. This is our mirror. Your own. Our own mug. Little matching mugs. I love it. This is the type of stuff you like when you're an adult. I'm gonna sip some, I don't drink coffee, but I'll put some juice in it. <laughs> Thank oh you. Oh my god, I These love look good them. in the house too. Yeah, I know, they go so much. Yeah, I try Our to... grown selves. Thank you. Put shots in here. <laughs> you're welcome. <gasps> oh. So, they're oh actually two balls. Oh my gosh. Two plates. So you guys obviously <gasps> have your, the full These stack. are so nice that we can never use these Stay. for food. So pretty. Look at that. Yo, this smells like money. Adult. <laughs> <laughs> These are nice. Oh my gosh, thank you. Yeah. This is my mom's? Yeah. Thank you, mom. Thank you. <gasps> oh, it's in the gear. This is the whole tray. So you can put your mugs on it. This, this would be so... nice for today. We like, yeah, I know. Today, but like. You put like your mugs on here, and I was thinking you could put it like on there. Like, like on shop? display? Yeah. <gasps> These are so nice. Ooh. Shake where this is a choker? Bye. <laughs> oh, this is some nice wrapping paper. Yeah. I'm feeling it. It's my favorite book. Emily Ratajkowski, You Changed My Life. Aw, I'm excited to read this. But if this book is going to change your life, like, you need to read it. I'm excited to read this, honestly. He told me I would relate to this book a lot, so I'm excited yeah. to read it. This one's more, like, sentimentally. You guys telling me? This is my first time making a painting. Oh my god, this is so cute. Aww. Oh my god, this is so cute. It's you okay. guys. I call this piece Lean On Me, I Lean On You. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, this is so cute. This looks and like it us. It represents too. us. These are Thank my presents you. to my mother. <gasps> Versace. <laughs> oh my god. So cute. Oh my god, it's so hermoso. A mí me encanta Versace. Now she's opening with a little more enthusiasm. <laughs> and Versace. Oh. A little cat. I like Versace. 
Me gustan mucho los vasos. Oh, yeah. Soy adicta a los vasos. Oh, yeah. Estos son vasos for, para que vayas a trabajo. Sí. Y lo necesitaba, ¿sabes? ¡Ay, oh, qué bonito! Ya. Thank you, papá. Es un perfume. Mm. Oh, wow. Oh, so cute. Shout out to the real twins. Shout out to the real twins. It's, it's smells like oh, wow. Mira. Oh, smells good? Oh, yeah, it smells Mira. nice. Mira, yeah. Yeah. No, it smells good. That does smell good. That smells really good. Watch out, the twins. <laughs> oh, wow. It's a new one for your house. So oh, cute. Wow. Qué hermoso está. Oh, my God, Faye. Gracias. Yes, todo de Versace. Okay, guys, it's a gift for you. To Fenty and Chanel from Uncle Fed. It's for their new little crib. Wow. Look at this. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Mom, I just made your new quiz. Oh, oh. oh. she just burped. Newest from Katie. Now I can see it. Cozy, cozy. It's a, it's a like blanket. It's a snuggie. Oh my god. Because you're not cold. cold. Yeah. When you're cold, yeah. It's literally so cold. Oh, I love it. It's big and cozy. Yeah, because I know you would probably wear it. You need to go outside or something. Yeah, yeah. I would literally like, wear this to the mall. <laughs> <laughs> this is me all day. And I have It's like my favorite robes <gasps> ever. Is it soft? Yeah, it's very soft. This is the Cayman. Oh. <laughs> Carla's giving out all of my gifts that I'm giving, but this is one of them. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Cayman. <laughs> you have to smell it. Ay, qué rico huele. You know me, I'm the king of supreme. Supreme ashtray. It looks like chicken. It's like Thanksgiving dinner. Oh, okay. Supreme kitchen towels. What? <gasps> Versace, Versace, Versace. Son como cositas que puedes poner en tu casa. Yeah. A supreme oh. vase. <laughs> From me and Cayman to you. Oh my God, Lueve. Ma, this is de mí, Cayman para ti. Hey. Or she can put it as decoration for Christmas yeah. or whatever she wants. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. I didn't even see that part. Oh, wow. I didn't see that part either. <gasps> Mira lo que dice. No, en el perfume. Dice Roses de. Tiene tus iniciales. Ah, Tiene mis iniciales. Yeah, yeah. initials. Oh. Yes. I know. Yeah. Which I told him and he's like, no, I think that's kind of cute. Yeah. Wow. Just smell it. Ah, uh -huh, like huélelo. Oh my gosh. Is this Louis Vuitton? Carla wants to keep it for herself. So. I know. Yo le dije, ¿por qué no me lo compraste a mí? Qué mal. <laughs> he didn't know. <laughs> oh my god. I know it's so so fucking oh good. I want it for myself so oh, bad. Thank you, Kame. Thank hey, you so much. <laughs> that smells good. No uh, lie. It does smell good. Oh. Oh. Nice oh. Is there glasses? <gasps> Wait. Stop it right now. <laughs> I wanted these too. I have. I thought they were. I have so the blue cute. ones and like a different oh shape, but God. I wanted this shape. After I saw it, I was like, "Ew!" I got the wrong shape. No, I think they're the so shape. cool. So oh cute. God, I love them. Thank you guys so much. You're welcome. So these are the gifts that I got came in, and then he has another gift upstairs. I already got him. All right, first gift. Ooh, Prada. Oh. Prada. Me. Prada. Prada or nada. Ooh. Prada shades. Oh, these are nice and little classic. Uh -huh. Oh, these look nice. Oh. Handsome, handsome. I'm, I'm, I'm acting different now. <laughs> it's giving men in black. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. My foot. We have more Prada. Oh. I'm gonna have all the shades for the summer. Oh. It's giving summer vibes. Oh, wow. That one is cute. I like this. <laughs> <laughs> I like them too. Thank you, babe. You're welcome. It says the real, real. Y'all know Carlos is the real, real Carla J. It's my store. If no one knew it's my store. We have some sweats. <laughs> some supreme sweats. Oh. <laughs> Very subtle. Those are really cute. 
Yeah, and they're really, they're and like actually, oversized. Yeah. I like that. That'd actually fit you. This kind of go Christmassy vibes, huh? Yeah. yeah. A little bit. They're like cargo y mm -hmm. shape. Yeah, that's why I, I like, like that. them. 10 out of 10. Thank 10 you. 10 10. This is wish list, and I don't know what any of this is, by the way. This is all on my Amazon wish list, and this is a game headset. It's I've been wanting this one really bad. Yeah, so don't don't complain when I'm using it on the game. What? Okay. You want all the attention to be on you, huh? Oh. These are actually really, really nice speakers. These are really good quality speakers. I'm gonna turn these up tonight if I have energy stuff. Ooh. Carla, Carla. Me, me. Of course. Wait, this is to me. Why did you have me over this? Oh, one? I didn't know. Oh. What Open is it? it. I have no idea what it is. Oh my gosh. It's crate and oh, barrel. No, but I I picked them out just for you. Bowls. Hey, when you get older, stuff like this is like all you want. Yeah. Bowl, this oh. is like a perfect noodle bowl. Uh-huh. Oh my goodness. You don't understand, like late at night when you want some noodles. Like Chick this from is, noodles? Uh, this is the bowl. The perfect bowl. Okay, this one is to Lewis. These are to Carla. Uh. Mm. <laughs> Carla. <laughs> Thank you very much. Louis. Louis. Yeah. I'm like opening them fast. Oh my. I actually want to read that book too. You do? If anybody knows me, I'm a reader. And I've been wanting to read this can book. I, can you pass it on to us after? Yeah. I'm glad my mom died. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That'll be a fun, a fun project. Oh, Lego orchid. But the orchids are so cheap. Yeah. Those are nice. <laughs> this is the one that they spray in the store. They do Alistair spray that at the store. Party. Yeah. Lewis would want some shit like that. I was like, which ones do you guys spray in the store? And it's this one. It's gonna bring Hollister back. Yeah, I love smelling it like Lewis a Lewis is bringing Hollister back. <laughs> She said it's not give, it's not wrapped, but so sorry. It's okay. So cute. Roberto Cavalli. Roberto Cavalli for like glasses. We well not whiskey. We do say. Now the one I always mess up is Paul Paul. Oh Jean. Paul Jean Paul. I can't even say it. Right <laughs> este es un libro. Your yeah. mother's story. Algún día vas a tener un bebé y quiero que escribas la historia. De tu vida, de, de él contigo uh -huh. y se lo regales a él. O ella. O ella. Uh -huh. Ajá. Ella o, o él. It yeah. says your mother's story. And then it has like, wait, mom, I want to know everything about you. Give this book to your mother to fill out and return back to you. So you're going to fill it out for your future kids. Yeah. What did you hate, love the most about growing up? And then, what was the hardest lesson for you to learn as you grew up? So, like, mm -hmm. there's all these... So, you write in, like, each moment. Do you, did you have an after-school job or did you want one? Tell me more about it. Did you ever rebel? If so, what did you do? Oh, my gosh. This is for my future kid. Well, now you have, like, a nice little book to put in your bookshelf. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so cute. More Prada? The white version. Wow. It's giving vacation vibes. Ooh. 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 Fancy. Yeah. You know. you know, I'm in my soft girl era right now. Well, kind of, sort of. So cute. So chic. Ballet slippers, but make it extra. So chic. So cute, thanks babe. That's so what I've been waiting to open since I've seen the box. Everybody knows that green. Oh my god, wait, I love this green string. I want it. I didn't know they even wrapped it like that. I didn't. Oh my, I want it did so string. good. <gasps> oh, uh, so gorgeous, so beautiful, so chic. So chic. So me. Oh, I love it. Thank you, babe. Thank you so much. How's it feel? Oh, wow. It's soft. Si, se mira. Oh, you have Fenty in there. <laughs> I know, but do it fit perfectly. All right, guys, so that is it for our little Christmas get together. At the house. This is our first time having like a Christmas event here. Did you guys enjoy it? Yeah. Are you tired? Yeah. It's because of the shots. Me too, I'm tired. We're going to take one more shot and then we're going to, I don't know what we're going to do, but thank you guys for watching another video. If you liked it, don't forget to subscribe, leave a like. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas.
Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Año Nuevo. Feliz Año Nuevo. Yeah. Happy Merry Christmas and every whatever you celebrate. Happy okay. Hanukkah. Happy Hanukkah. 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 Happy Kwanzaa. Happy whatever else there is. For Christmas, one of the girls' gifts was a bigger bed. So they both sleep in the same bed. They used to have two separate beds, but mm -hmm. would constantly go just in the same one. So they obviously wanted to sleep together. So we ended up just like, obviously the other one wasn't going in her own cage. They like sleeping together. So this is their old cage. Obviously it's small because they are small. But for Christmas, we wanted to get one that's a little bit more aesthetically pleasing. And they sleep in our room, so I wouldn't have it either way. She's like, are you taking my cage? <laughs> but they're gonna sleep so much better. Now I just have to go. Actually, I'm gonna go to Home Goods tonight because I need to get a couple last things for Christmas platters. And I'm probably gonna pick up like a cute little bed that's big enough for the both of them in here. And my idea is, yes, this does not have a top, but usually I would always just put this over like this. Yeah. I'm gonna have like a cute little bed. They're gonna have cute little stuffed animals in there because I actually got some like this. My mom got her this one. There's some that they're getting for Christmas. Obviously guys, this isn't like the full product, but yeah. we're just showing them to get them acclimated to their new sleeping space. Yeah. Do you Are like you it, Chanelli, or no? I think Vinci likes Fincy it. Vinci likes it, look. <laughs> yeah, we'll make sure it's extra cozy in there and we'll get them a bed and it should be really fun for them They got a new home. So it is Christmas Day in Portland, Oregon. Carla and me are in Portland right now We've actually been here for like two or three days. Mm -hmm. You've been enjoying it, huh? Mm -hmm. It actually snowed the first two days and we couldn't even like nice. leave. It was kind of it was nice but it was kind of like Park because like there's ice everywhere. It's Christmas right now. We're gonna be heading to my mom's house right now. We're at my dad's, so we're heading to my mom's. We're gonna go celebrate real quick, and it should be exciting. We've had like four Christmases already. We had really? like one at my other side with your mom and your mm -hmm. brother. Now we're going to another one, but it's so cool. It's our third one. Oh yeah! Merry Christmas to you guys. Merry Christmas. I'm over here eating food. I ain't supposed to be eating, but mm -hmm. we're at my sister's spot. <laughs> if you guys didn't know, you, we saw her on the vlog before, but this is my sister, yeah. Brianna. Hey. This is my oldest younger sister. Mm -hmm. Obviously, y'all seen Kayla too. This yes. is my little brother. Let's go with Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. <laughs> he over here Happy drinking. holidays. What is it? <laughs> what, what is that? Y'all see that? Yeah, of course. <laughs> I ain't even drink some of this yet. And then Carla's right here. Behind the cam. <laughs> I'm the camera woman today. <laughs> so we actually just opened gifts and now we're making gingerbread houses. Gingerbread yeah. houses. Yeah, we'll see how ours turn out. I think ours will be the best. Uh, we're wrong. We're gonna, we're, gonna see, we're gonna see. So we just put these together. It's been pretty easy, right? Yeah. So we're playing Uno, but it's Uno Deer. So the deer is for Kayla. She has to blow the top part off the pile. Mm -hmm. Just. Yeah. Just the top though. It's mm -hmm. kind of set up already for her to do one. You gotta straighten up. But, yes, but, 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 she has asthma. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to everybody with asthma. I know, I know it's not in the play way, but when she breathes, if you laugh, you're going down. Hold on. I want to get a little loader. Oh my god. Hello Yeah. Yeah, make it more slanted. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> My turn. Yeah. Okay, I, I'll say it slow. Okay, teach us. Okay, yeah. so you basically like go like, arriba, which is up. Arriba. 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 Ar I'm driving, guys, so I'm not, I'm not yes. doing all that. There are six answers on the board. A hundred people were asked to name something you would like to do alone. We said. Well, yeah. What did we already say? We said read and sleep. You only said read. You didn't say sleep yet. Yes, she did. Yeah, she did. And there was one X, right? One yeah. X. Okay. Six. Yeah. Okay. Um, watch TV. That is the number six answer. Yay. Okay. Three more. Cook. 
Dang, what? Is that three X's? That's two. You stuck? Yeah. You alright? Yeah. How much time do you got? Okay, okay, okay. Alright, five okay. seconds. Okay, uh. Clean. <laughs> okay, two answers left on the board. Paint. Name something you like to be alone to do. Use the bathroom. Mm. That is one answer, so you wow. saw the <laughs> Wow. Wow, wow. <laughs> 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 okay, anything for the channel? Um, I miss you guys. I'm gonna Oh my god. <laughs> You'll see more of me real soon.